And as temperatures dive below zero in Colorado, much of the state is also digging out this morning. Snow plows have been working all night in some areas to clear more than a foot of snow. Airlines canceled dozens of flights at Denver International Airport. Meteorologist Megan Glaros of our Chicago station, WBBM, is tracking the storm. Thanks, Charlie and Nora. Now the winter storm that has been plaguing us all week shifts direction. Now it focuses on folks from West Texas up through Oklahoma into the Ohio River Valley and up to Pennsylvania in the next couple of days. Snow on the northern extent of the storm, rain to the south, and in between an ice storm. We anticipate seeing ice accumulation on roadways anywhere from Texas up through Tennessee into Kentucky, West Virginia, and eventually Pennsylvania today into tomorrow. This will mean significant travel impacts as well as power outages, ice accumulation on power lines and things of that nature. We are talking about snow on the northern extent of this system that could top five inches in Springfield, top four inches in Oklahoma, and mean about an inch and a half around Indianapolis. The cold air is still invading some of the coldest air we have had in over three years from much of the nation.